Hey guys, it's me again, and today I come with another tutorial. How to make a piston elevator. Now, <laughs> this was not my idea, but it is my design. Now, this was, uh, no, no, no. Let's go, wait a second. Um, let's go. Alright, well, this probably is the best, uh, example. This is his design. Uh, I mean, the guy that originally did it, his design. And uh, what it is, is it goes redstone, 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 into a repeater, into a block, which goes into that redstone, which goes into that repeater, which runs redstone into the block below as well. Now, and then it repeats that process, but it's so bulky. I thought, no, 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 no. So my design is much more compact, as you can see. It, that's his, that's mine. Um, Nine doesn't require a whole bunch of repeaters and a whole bunch more redstone. All mine requires is torch, block, torch, redstone, redstone, redstone. Torch, block, torch, and then you can continue it. So, I'll show you guys how to make this. Now, I will show you how it works first, I guess. And I'll show you how to make it, but uh, there are some bugs with the uh, pistons still. And I'll show you an example of what one of those bugs are, and what it does is it makes me have to add a monostable circuit to the button. So, this is how it works. And look at that, I'm, I'm, I'm up here. Already. <laughs> so yeah, it works. It works pretty damn good. And, um... Yeah. Now, what the glitch is, is... When a piston, the block above a piston, is powered, even if it's air, then <laughs> that block will... I mean, the piston won't retract. See, now, I've taken a chunk of that and put it over here to show an example. If I were to hit this button, everything works fine. But because a button has a pulse length, I think, of 12 ticks, there's only 6 ticks that go around. And so, finally, when the 6th tick comes around and lights this up, this tries to retract after however many ticks, but it can't. Because this is lit up now. But that'll, of course, disappear in another six ticks. But, because it is lit up right now, this won't retract. And if I break the torch even and undo all power to it, it still won't retract. Which is a big bug in the uh, pistons right now. So, how, what I did to fix that was, since it takes a full six ticks to go all the way around, what I did was I added a monostable circuit, which makes the button pulse length only six ticks. I mean, sorry, five ticks. One tick below, but... <laughs> Enough time to make it so it stop. Oh my god! Stop! Stop! <laughs> oh shit! He <laughs> almost blew up my uh, pulse lengthener. I mean, no, my monostable circuit. So this, this here is my monostable circuit. Just an easy thing to set up so that the pulse you know, is shorter. Holy shit, that scared me. <laughs> Alright, now, <laughs> let's get on to building it. Oh, hey. Um. Uh, as you can see, I've done, run a couple different tests on this, like using a pressure plate and stuff. I don't know why, but I can't get the pressure plate to work. <laughs> um, uh, like I say, I'm still sure buttons. <laughs> okay, so let's get to work on see how it's made. Okay, we are not on that show, but still. <laughs> um, how should I start? Whatever. We'll put a piston here in the ground one up and put a piston there. And so basically this will push up and then this push out. Now where I put the button was right here. Why? Easy access, I don't know. You just walk in, stand in the corner, push the button and you're off. But of course that's not gonna happen. Because there's no rest on it. So there's all you're gonna want to do it for first is the first well it's kinda weird. Um first you're gonna wanna make this kind of spiral staircase, so just go one up to the left, one up, one up and keep doing that for your desired height so since this is just a tutorial because my design can be repeated very easily there's no need for me to go too high might as well go, I don't know since this is just tutorial purposes I'll make it go uh, you come out the same way you're going, so basically what I'm saying is there and there. Okay. 
And now that we have our little spiral here, our spiral staircase, now we gotta add the ones on the sides. So I just go, oops, boink, boink. And then we do it again on the other side. And this design is very, very, ugh, very fluent. So you can just keep doing this all the way up because then you get a piston to place your block on. It's like, oh, I see. No, I'm just, <laughs> yeah. And just keep going up. This is the last one. Yes, it is. Okay. So now we have our piston set up. Now we just gotta wire it. Now, some the, some people think the wiring is just so scary. Kind of is sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. So, how I set it up. Um, first off, we put a torch there. Block here. Torch here. And we take the block here. Block, block. Leave that open. Press down. And glass. Glass is just so you can stand against it while the current can still go through it. it. May not look like it will, but it will. Trust me. Trust me. <laughs> and then we do the same process all over again. See what this is running into? You put a torch there. Block there. Torch. And go point, point, point. Redstone, 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 glass, torch, block. As you can see, it's very repetitive, but it works great. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, not being, I'm not conceited or anything, but my design is pretty good. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's see here. And it doesn't take up a whole bunch of room like that one over there. <laughs> um, and then, and then, let's go. I don't make any sense. I don't know, but let's just get this thing made. So then I'll stop the sound. <laughs> uh, alright, alright, here we go, here we go. Almost to the top. Of course, you might need ladders or something. Actually, no. Yeah, if I was building this little shit, I could. <laughs> uh, no, I don't know. Oh, okay. <laughs> so let's have it. Okay, figure out a way to build it yourself. It's not hard. See now, the guy over there, he was using one tick delays on repeaters, but, well, torches are one tick of delay, so I didn't see much point in the uh, repeaters. There. Perfect, though. Now, we gotta hook up the button. Other than that, our wiring is done. The button is pretty easy, but until they fix that glitch, it's gonna be a pain in the ass, because, like, you know, lo them locking in place for no reason is kinda stupid. But who cares? We can fix it. <laughs> um, going down. We're just going to go as deep as we can so we can hide the uh, monastery circuit. Monastery circuit is one, two, three blocks high. So I'm going to go one more. Actually, we should go one more because the torch. No, no, no. The torch won't interfere with anything. Alright. Okay, so let's, let's 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 make this in here. Boink, boink. One, two, uh, three. There, so we have five ticks now. And then we just cover this. Put it. Put the torch on top. So redstone. Going up to here. Torch. And then we gotta leave that torch all the way over there. <laughs> I guess we can just take it up one by one at a time. And of course, you know, I'm gonna be cheating a little bit and flying into the ground. You just gotta dig it up here, I guess. I don't know, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. I don't wanna be too cheap. <laughs> Um, where did I run it in last time? I ran it in here. Okay. Seven, eight, nine. 
10, 11, 12, 13, 14. All right, it works. Now I gotta smash it all oops, away. Now it should work. Oh well, I'm just taking it. Cover that up. See now if we. Where is it? There it is. There's the torch underneath. That's the only thing that you might want to watch out for if you. Otherwise, you would just put one deep down. So, now our button's hooked up. I'm just standing in the corner here. Push a button and. Uh, why didn't it work? Okay, something. Uh, is it just me? It's built exactly the same. Okay, I'm gonna make the tick, uh, the lengthener shorter. It's kinda gay. It should work. No, 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 it should work, no matter what. Like, oh, man. Oh, man. See, and then they just won't retract, and yada yada. Why are there so many problems with these now? <laughs> the one elevator works fine, and then another one I tried to make didn't work for some reason. And then, there we go. There we go. Oh, see, now the pulse is too short, so it won't even reach all of them. Maybe it was just me. Maybe I'm retarded. Whoops. There goes my glass to stand on. Well, anyways, maybe I'm the only one having a glitch, but, um, that's how you build it. Let's see if we can even get it working, though. It's built exactly the same. Don't, don't, don't depress me. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna quickly restart my game. Hold on a second. So, I found a fix. I realized what was happening was um, these were getting pushed up before I was getting pushed into them and so therefore I wasn't going up so <laughs> the fix I have for it is going to involve repeaters but it doesn't make the structure any bigger or anything all it does is you take the redstone that we had underneath this glass block and add a repeater uh, move it and put a repeater uh, see like we used to have that there I broke it and put a repeater there. That's all you need to do, and uh, it works actually perfectly now. It, there, it, there, it, it just works even better than before. No more glitchiness. So, um, yeah, 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 that'll be the end. See ya.